Hi guys, Happy New Year and welcome back to All Things Nail, where you can find a little bit of everything all in one place. So, I know a lot of you do not watch regular TV. For those of us that still do, I'm just going to run over a few of my favorite shows that will be starting January 2019. So, stay tuned. Well, today is January the 1st, so it was very important that I go on and get this done and get this out there because, because tomorrow is the second, and with tomorrow being the second, a lot of our favorite shows do start. Starting off with Black Ink Crew Chicago. Let me tell you what, they came back quick. I don't know about y'all, but to me, it just went off, and they are already back. This is what I like about the Black Ink franchise. They don't do like a bunch of other shows leave you hanging for a whole year before they, sh they show come on. When one show go off, the next show be coming on. And I love that. So, I can't wait for the drama and see what's going to happen because you know when it went off, not, um, Ryan had bought the old nine mag back. So basically he got two nine mags. And if any of y'all have ever watched any of my other show reviews, I told y'all one of those show reviews, it, it sounded like it was going to be some black ink New York type of thing going on where he going to end up having his own, he going he gonna to be having multiple shops and this is just their way of doing it. See, this how you know stuff be scripted. Moving right along. So, that'll start January the 2nd, which is tomorrow, which is Black Ink Crew Night, Wednesday, right? Okay, so getting into that, before Black Ink Crew, uh, Ink Crew Chicago come on, we will be graced with Love & Hip Hop Miami. It'll start back tomorrow. It's always some type of Love & Hip Hop going on. It's so many of them now. Most time, it's two of them on at one time. I don't hardly watch... Well, my favorite one is Atlanta. I liked New York, but New York got to ghetto. I liked New York when it started out, but now it's getting to the people they have on there is too crappy and it's getting too cultish for me, if you know what I mean by cult. But anyway, so that's why I don't be feeling it that much. I feel like they should give Remy and Cardi B her own show. Um... I would say Little Mo, but I'm not here for Little Mo. Little Mo after she shaded Queen Naja the way she did. I didn't agree with everything that she said about Queen Naja, so right now I'm just not for it. And I love Little Mo when she's singing, but she know, uh, she don't need to just sing. She like K Michelle. You need to, you need to be heard singing, and that's it. So the next show that's coming on that I really like is. The have and the have not. Girl. Let me tell you, that show everything, it be giving me life. That's my Tyler Perry. Come on the own network. It starts back January the second. Baby, it just went off. They just had I I call it a mid-season break. It ain't been off long enough to say it was off. And this is what I'm saying. I like this. I like it come back on quick. Though it should it that I, I'm not a big fan of the mid-season breaks. Because just show the show. If you got 24 episodes recorded, show us 24 episodes. Don't show us eight um, and break them up throughout the year. Uh, that's I feel like that's just a ripoff to me. And then I, at least give me 10 episodes. Or, then take your mid-season break. But five to six episodes of mid-season break, that's not enough. But I will tell you what. If loving you is wrong, they gave me a handful of episodes, so I guess I better not be complaining before he do like his other show. We'll get to that show in a minute. Then they got Grownish Season 2 coming back on. It's going to be on Freeform. Um, it starts tomorrow. They got so much stuff coming on tomorrow. My, my DVR going to be full because you know I'm going to be watching VH1 and let something better come on. The next thing that y'all got to be here for is This Is Us. This Is Us mid-season um, will return. And it was season three they were in, but it's the mid-season. Their return, January the 15th, which is my son's birthday. Love you, son. Hey. So anyway, 
some other shows that I am waiting for for the 2019, the beginning of 2019, because you know my other shows will come late in the year, but for the beginning of this year, I was waiting for If Love You Is Wrong by Tyler Perry, because they do a season, child. They I'm, they better not be late with this season coming on, because I've been on everybody's um, snaps and Instagrams and Twitters and YouTubes, and they don't have nothing about the new um, season of If Love You Is Wrong. All I know is it's coming back in 2019. Last Last year, I want to say it started in March. So maybe it'll be on time for this year when Tyler Perry gets to making his own shows and his own movies and whatnot. He tend to kick what he doing to the side, the things that we like and all of that. Cause y'all know he killing my deal. He finna stop playing my deal. Um, and I don't blame him. Um, when he's he talking about um he don't want to be 60 still playing my deal, and I understand that, but this is my thing. It's so many people that can imitate him doing my deal that's really good some of them better than him that I think he should let one of them um take on my deal and play my deal if he tired of playing it let one of them play for a little while and then we never get tired hell let the next one play that's how you do that so we'll see and the next show I'm waiting for baby is Queen Sugar honey they better come back and bring me this Queen Sugar because I got to find out because we all know how it ended. But come on, give me something. And I still think Ralph Angel going to want um, Darla back because as soon as she, she started liking somebody else, he's going to be back up in her face. But we'll see. And I don't know about y'all, but I, I, in a way, want Charlie and Davis to get back together because at this point, I don't know. I don't care for Davis, but I'm like, he need to learn a lesson. Is he going to learn a lesson? Not learn a lesson? So somebody tell me something. Um, kind of, um, I like Nova, but I don't think it was right with her and Remy. Y'all had all of this time before Charlie got there to be interested in each other. Y'all wait till Charlie get there. Um, and you done been screwing Charlie. Then now try to be interested in Nova. Why won't y'all interested all the other times? She just stayed down in the bayou. It ain't like she never lived there. Charlie was in, in L.A. But that's how people do, child. That's how people do. So anyway, those are the shows we have for to look forward for. That's not all of them. That's not all the shows that's coming on. That's just what I'm watching right now. So it's other shows. Enjoy your shows. I can't keep up with YouTube and these shows. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to check out some of my old show reviews for shows that you haven't seen just to get caught up because you ain't got time to watch a whole season. So just thumb through them if you want to catch up with something that you're new to and then you'll be ready to go. I thank you guys for watching. Tons of hugs and kisses and lots of love. And y'all know your girl love you like a fat kid love cake. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.